Cattle are gregarious herd animals and communicate through a series of oral and other signals. They enjoy each other's company and become distressed when separated from herd mates. Cows are loyal and affectionate animals who develop lasting relationships and who can remember both good and bad events for years. Mother cows and their offspring form tight bonds and in a natural environment, calves will nurse for more than a year. But sadly, young calves who are raised for veal never have a chance to play or even go outside. To produce veal, young calves are taken away from their mothers at birth and chained by the neck in crates measuring just two feet wide. This is where they spend their entire lives, unable to walk, turn around, or even lie down comfortably. This severe confinement makes the calves' meat tender, since the animal's muscles cannot develop. Veal calves experience chronic stress and exhibit neurotic coping behaviors. Calves raised for veal are fed an all-liquid diet, which is purposely deficient in iron and fiber. It is intended to produce borderline anemia and the pale-colored flesh sold as veal. At just five months of age, these weak animals are slaughtered. They would not survive into adulthood because their diets prevent normal development of their digestive system. In many instances, veal calves don't even make it to slaughter, and dead calves are a common sight at veal farms. This calf collapsed while being herded into the slaughterhouse truck and was left to suffer where he fell in the alleyway of a veal barn. The production of veal is inherently cruel, and it should be banned in the United States as it has been in other countries.